say goodnight. Men old enough to be my father. I mean, like, middle-aged. They were clutching each other, like Romeo and Juliet. His hand and his hand on each other's bottoms. One last kiss, they say goodnight. One disappears down this, this alley, comes up to this concrete building. So he's strolling along, you know, to this men's room. Walks down these, walks down these stairs, moving in. No, I don't even stop to think. I don't even, t I don't even tell the guys to like follow me. Just motion them. So I get in. It's like a different place. Walls exploding with graffiti. Place stinks. Two bulbs burnt out. And some, some old guy curled up in the, curled up in the corner. And our friend's legs, patiently waiting, without a care in the world. So I slip into the booth next to him, start fumbling with my belt, this, that. And like clockwork, this, this guy's hand comes up, imploring. A little gold ring catches the light. I put my hand in his, in his palm. We walk up to this stainless steel mirror, you know, sizing each other up. Name's Chet. I don't even bat an eyelash, and he, and he moves in. His, his tongue playing across my cheek. His hand down my zip. You know what I do? I look him on the cheek as well. Just for a second. For a second! They are that blow a whistle, you know? One that makes a tongue linger. Then Tim and Dave come up behind them. I take the first punch. He hits the sink, all bloody and snotty you now. Then he gets on his knees, starts begging and pleading. We start beating him, kicking him, you know, finding a new spot each time because his head gets softer. Then I look over. Now I look over to Tim. Me and Dave, we don't, we don't really know this guy. I'm wondering, what is he thinking? I like to answer our prayers. He picks up this, this metal trash can thing and, and raises it above his head. And he, and he whispers, that, I'll never forget that. And then he brings it tumbling down onto this guy's back. Boom. Wow. So he stop, stare at this guy, looks at what we've done. This guy probably will never be able to walk again. Legs are mashed up. It's hideous. So we run off, howling like school kids. <laughs> Laughing, laughing out loud. It was just so funny. It was just such a perfect way to end it.